Hey guys, so right now I will show you how to easily create a channel in Slack. It's very useful information, especially if you are a new Slack user. So in few words, what is Slack? Slack is communication platform for companies. So basically, if you have WhatsApp or Facebook messengers and you communicate between each other, between people, so Slack is kind of like group chat for companies. Okay, so first thing, when you're logging to Slack is how to create your new channel. So a short overview. So this is uh, my Slack interface and right now I will show you how to create a new channel. So uh, there are three types of uh, channels in Slack. There is public channel. Uh, they are used for conversations open to all members. There are private channels uh, and you have to be invited to join a private channel to view it in Slack and a private channel has a lock icon next to its name. And recently there are also shared channels. These are channels uh, which can be shared between different companies. So basically what is the difference between private and public channels? So uh, public channels can be joined by anyone in your company and they can appear in search uh, of uh, your Slack. So if anyone searches for some info, this channel can pop up. So if you have some sensitive information in your channel and you don't want anyone in your company to access it, so just make a private channel. Um, and here is an overview how to do it. Uh, so let's just do it. Uh, so important thing to notice that uh, there is 21 character long limit on channel name. So you can't create more than 21 characters and uh, uh, your channel obviously should have a unique name. Um, uh, also there are reserved names in Slack. So uh, these channel names can't be created because they're already in Slack. So let's try and do it. So it's actually really easy. So in your Slack interface, you just go to this section channels. You mm, click a plus symbol and then you can create a channel here. You can select what I said, if, if it's either a public channel or it's a private channel. So you see if I have a private channel, I have a lock icon here. So let's just create a public channel. We can add the purpose here it's uh, not re a requirement and then you can already send invitations to this slack uh, channel so you can uh, just add users who are in, in your slack uh, group and invite them and then you just uh, yes so that's how it is and here you receive two notifications that others in your workspace can join from the channel list and you can invite other people now. So uh, the same you can just invite other people as well. If, if there are any people you just uh, start typing their name and they will appear here. Uh, but as well if you want to join some channel you can just type in search test channel and you will immediately join that channel. So that's how easy it is, uh, nothing complicated. You can also see member list of this channel, uh, the highlights of this channel, some information. Uh, also there are pinned items and uh, you can add specific uh, notification preferences exactly for these channels, as well as you can see which all files were shared in this channel and you can access them at any time. So this is like basically an overview how to easily create your channel and it works uh, practically same on uh, desktop or iOS or Android or Windows phone. So you need to press the same plus icon in the channels header and then you, you will have the same options. So hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.